Hey everybody, it's Gordon Dixon here. Um, here to talk to you today about the uh, the Helios 2, which is my signature line with Monster Barrel Designs. Um, I've actually got the uh, the Helios 1 and the Helios 2 here. Um, so I want to pull up both of them so you guys can take a look and see what, uh, what exactly we did different. So here are the two. I'll let the, uh, the focus come in there. Um, you can see the Helios 2 is uh, the one on top. And the one on the bottom is actually the one I've been using for the past uh, two years, or one of the three that I've been using for the past two years. Um, and uh, it's a, it was the very first set that they sent me, so it's uh, that's why it's got Gordon on it. Um, but you can see the the front end a little bit different um, with the uh, with the new lines here that uh, that Monster is able to do with their uh, their machines, um, but still with the uh, the knurling, the round knurling here at the at the very front. Um, you probably won't be able to see it in this, uh, in this video, but, uh, it does have, um, about two millimeters, I believe longer than the, uh, than the original. And as we move back here, you can see where we've moved back the, um, the kind of rib cut here, uh, in the, in the very back. And all that, all that was, was, uh, me kind of, um, uh, fine tuning where exactly I'm holding the dart. So that, uh, that seemed to be where I pinpointed uh, that I used my, my thumb the most. So that's where we, uh, where we moved those, uh, that rib cut to. Um, also, you'll also notice right in front of that is that, uh, that little indentation where the, uh, where the logo um, for Helios and uh, Monster is. And that's, uh, that's another, again, another option for, for, uh, for anybody else that throws the dart. Um, as another piece of uh, knurling for them to uh, to get some grip. Um, oh, you do see that it uh, that it is a tad longer, um, and then the uh, the shark cut, wave cut, whatever you uh, want to call it, there in the back, in some type of a piece of string. Um, so there's a, there's a close up of the two barrels um, side by side, um, the the steel tip versions. I'm going to do another one for uh, soft tip because there are some. Uh, um, some new things that uh, that I want to make mention of because uh, it's also going to come in the uh, number five tip. Uh, but again, I'll go over that in the uh, soft tip um, video. So here's here's the dart completely assembled with uh, the new orange and white um, Gordon Dixon flights. Sounds weird to say that. Um, so the other thing I wanted to show you is where the balance point is um, on the uh, on the new set. So it's right right uh right on that knurling right in front of that knurling um so still pretty center balanced um i was worried when i first saw these that they were going to be a little bit uh um front loaded the, with the uh the way the cuts are but again the balance point turned out to be uh um spot on um the the 22 gram which is what it'll be boxed at um will be at uh 20 grams and four 20.4 for the for just the barrel and tip um, and then uh, 22 once you put uh, the rest of the stuff on there so again uh, you get a little bit more exact as far as where I actually hold the dart in the middle of the middle of the tip um, again I've, I'm very very proud of them uh, can't wait to uh, to get them out to everybody um, and see what uh, see what everybody thinks so that's the uh, comparison between the uh, the old steel uh, Helios ones and the new steel Helios ones. If you have any questions, you can, uh, shoot them over to me at, uh, the action dads at yahoo.com. Um, and I will, uh, get back to you. Thanks.